AJHS, and I'm back with another video. Um, guys, in today's video, I will be giving you a little detour and a little rundown of the Air Jordan 13 um, retros, um, as most of us like to call them, the Air Jordan 13 Starfish. You know what I'm saying, um, first, before we get into this video, guys, um, I want to say I, I like these sneakers, you know what I'm saying? These weren't the sneakers that I actually was supposed to get around the time. I was actually supposed to get a different pair. I was actually supposed to um, go for the OG University Blue Nines, but I wound up seeing these and I wound up getting these because I actually have a sweater to match those, um, match these sneakers, um, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, I thought these sneakers were fire, you know what I'm saying? So, I wound up getting them, you know what I'm saying? But... I don't want to take up too much time, but let's get right into it, you know what I'm saying? Um, oh yeah, before we get started, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, you know what I'm saying? Go tune into my other YouTube channel, I will put that down in the in the description below, you know what I'm saying? But without further ado, let's get into it. So guys, what we have here... Uh, the 13s, Air Jordan 13s, Starfish, you know what I'm saying, as you guys can see, you know what I'm saying, um, guys, these, I actually, um, like I said, I actually wasn't going for these at the time, but, you know, I, um, I seen them. I was like, all right, you know, I like them, so why not, you know, get them, you know what I'm saying? Um, so I just want to give you guys a little rundown of the sneaker, you know. So basically, these are the Air Jordan 13s, the Starfish. Um, oh, excuse me, guys. Um, these feature a, um, a white tumbled, a leather construction, um... Defining starfish orange, you know what I'm saying? Which is kind of like suede, you know what I'm saying? Then you got um like a white heel toe, you know what I'm saying? Um, um also you have uh the black, which has a uh, also this has um black lining on the inside, you know what I'm saying, with the um the orange jump man um logo, you know what I'm saying? which features the um, holographic green, which as you guys can see on the side, you know what I'm saying? This is a holographic green. You know, I'll try to make it more clear for you guys. You know what I'm saying? What I um, also has the uh, Jordan Jumpman logo on the bottom. You know what I'm saying? I, I kind of like to call this bottom, I like to kind of call it a checker bottom. You know what I'm saying? Um, Guys, these, when... These were actually scheduled to come out on January 2nd, but these wound up being released on January 16th. And the retail price for these guys were about, I think, the retail price for these were, I think, $190, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, $190, you know what I'm saying? Um, overall, I like the sneaker, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, I wasn't going to get it at first. But I like the sneaker, you know what I'm saying? It has good features, good qualities. I actually had to look at the sneaker at first, you know what I'm saying? Um, Actually, you guys can see it has a leather top, you know what I'm saying? Um, The white, it has a white tongue, you know what I'm saying? Um, it's, It, it kind of gives me like Miami Dolphin, you know what I'm saying? Miami Dolphin vibes, you know what I'm saying? Just by their colors, you know, the white, orange, you know what I'm saying? Kind of gives the Miami Dolphin vibes. But, um, guys, this is a good sneaker, you know what I'm saying? Um, it's available to all sizes, adults, kids, you know, um, teenagers, toddlers, whatever, you know what I'm saying? It's available to all sizes, you know, go get them. Um, yeah, I like these. Um, hold on, guys. Give me a minute, I'm just looking for something. Um, yeah, guys. Also, these have they have a um a black lining 
on the um the sole or whatever as you guys can see you know what i'm saying um not too many rough patches here you know what i'm saying this these actually i actually bought these in a size six i think it was a six or six and a half i think if you haven't guys um i'm gonna put the link down in the description below for the um the previous video i did i actually did on the um air jordan ones hyper blues you know what i'm saying um go tune into that video but yeah guys these you know what i'm saying feature like i said it's kind of like a suede you know it's a suede starfish color you know what i'm saying white heel toe um orange jump man like i said uh i would say like i would say leather but i would say kind of like a suede leather you know what i'm saying like not too much like the um the ones i showed you guys where it was more of like a synthetic leather this is more of like a suede leather guys you know what i'm saying um if you guys when i went and got these i didn't get these the day they came out i actually got these i would say about three weeks after and i only paid 140 for these and stop like i said when these came out they were going for about 190 you know what i'm saying and i think that was in all sizes you know what i'm saying um yeah you feel you see they got the feature jump man on the tongue um hold on guys i know i'm looking down too much i'm actually looking for something um yeah also if you guys like i would say it's is these i don't the well when i actually looked up online about these i mean i already got them but when i looked up online it said these were sold out but i actually went to the mall about two three days ago i seen a couple of these still but if you guys are like looking to get these or order them online like if you use sites like the goat or StockX or like flight club like i mean you'll be paying way more than you would be paying in a regular store you know what i'm saying like at flight club you'll be paying around about what at flight club you'll be paying around 240 goat you'll be paying around 240 um stock x you would be paying around like what 241 you know what i'm saying so they all kind of range in the same category you know what i'm saying but luckily for me i only pay 140 I guess it's because the size, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, guys, I didn't get these when they came out, you know what I'm saying? I actually got these about two to three weeks after, you know what I'm saying? Um, If you ask me, a lot of these niggas here, I mean, a lot of people wouldn't be too fond of them, I would say. Maybe because of the color or whatever, or because of how how they look, you know what I'm saying? But if you guys are looking to get these, you know what I'm saying? These wouldn't be hard to find, you know what I'm saying? Um, these actually, um, when I first got these, like, these actually reminded me of, because I actually had a pair of 13s. If you guys remember the 13s, I think they were black and blue, if I'm not mistaken, black and blue with the, um, with the holographic green, these actually kind of reminded me of those when they first came out, you know what I'm saying? Um, I believe these were actually Phoenix. I, I believe they were actually called Phoenixes when they when they first dropped, you know what I'm saying? Um, like I said, these uh MJ he had, you know what I'm saying? These actually resemble um the ones actually, Air Jordan ones. I don't know which one specifically. I don't want to really get into all that right now, but these actually resemble the Air Jordan ones, you know what I'm saying? Um But, you know, like I said, guys, if you're looking to cop these, you know what I'm saying, don't miss out, you know what I'm saying? They still got them in stock. Like I said, as I read online, they they um they said they're sold out. I don't know in how many stores, guys, but these if you're looking to get them guys they they'll 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 still be there you know what i'm saying um like i said guys like before like one thing one thing like when i first found out about these like if you guys know most like if you guys are sneakerheads kind of like i am you know what i'm saying um when they first when these first came out like the white part here like kind of like the tongue and everything and the sole 
that part was actually, this whole part was actually gonna, you know, the tongue and everything was actually gonna be black. And the suede part of this shoe that's black and the inside was going to be white, you know what I'm saying? That's how they were supposed to look when they first came out. A lot of people don't know that, but you know what I'm saying? I guess they didn't want to go with the color or anything, but I'm glad they actually kept it this color because when I seen them on how when they first um were supposed to come out, it, it kind of looks like um it kind of looks like the black, white, and red 13s with the red uh the red sole bottom on the bottom. And I'm like, you know, I, I like I said, I, I'm not really a fan of 13s. You know what I'm saying? My favorite Jordans are actually 9s, but these I had to get. But if I, like I said, um, I feel like these are the best condition they got them in. You know what I'm saying? Because if you guys, um, I will put the link down in the description below for you guys to go look and go see how these were gonna be before you know what i'm saying like i said this part you know by the tongue and everything and the sole um i think the jump man was still gonna be the same color orange i'm not really sure you know what i'm saying because i didn't really look too much at the um the jump man on the sole but i know from the sole and everything down you know what i'm saying um laces and everything they were gonna be black you know what i'm saying so meaning you know the black uh crease front and um you know, soles over here, everything that's black was going to be basically, you know, white. And um, inside, you know, where the uh, patent leather is by the black, that was going to be white too, you know what I'm saying? Um, but the orange, I think, the orange was still going to be the same. But for me, it just wouldn't have looked as amusing. And I feel like a lot of people wouldn't have bought them, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, like I see a lot of people... You don't see as much people with them. Well, I live in Staten Island, so I see a lot of people, you know, I don't see as much people with them, but when I go on like social media and stuff, I see a couple people with them, you know what I'm saying? So these are like rare to see people with, you know what I'm saying? But um, yeah, they actually have, you know, the Jordan words and, um, you know, orange and whatnot. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, it's a nice holographic green. I don't know if you guys can see it, as much you know probably when i put it back you guys can see it but these sneakers guys like i said they won't be hard to find you know what i'm saying so if you're going to look for them my my guess would be i bought these at um, a store called finish line you know what i'm saying if you live in staten island you know what i'm saying that's a good store i actually bought these at finish line i bought these for 140 plus tax it was about 152 so not that much you know what i'm saying um like I said, I was actually looking for the OG University 9s, you know what I'm saying? Um, and I was also looking for the black and gold 9s too, you know what I'm saying? But they didn't have either of those in my size. Like I mentioned in the last video, guys, if you want 9s, you have to get them when they are in the store, you know what I'm saying? Because 9s sell out fast, you know what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, guys, these are a good shoe, you know what I'm saying? So if you're looking to cop... Go cop, you feel what I'm saying? They still got them in stores. Like I said, I will put the link down in the description for, below for the store to go get these at. Um, once again, um, I mean, you could. You, there's a couple stores you could try, you know what I'm saying? You could probably try Foot Lock or you could probably try, like, Clientele. One thing about, I'm going to tell you guys about Clientele, though, is Clientele is not like most stores. Clientele is not like Finish Line or, like, Foot Lock or where you'll be paying around, like, 140 or depending on your size, you know what I'm saying? That clientele, you'll probably be paying not even half off. You'll, you'll probably be paying for these, you'll probably be paying around like 200 or like 210, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, guys, the retail price for these were 190, you know what I'm saying? But I don't know if it's my size. I, I say that all the time, but yeah, the retail price for these guys when they came out were 190. I don't know what's the retail price now, but the retail price was 190 when these first came out, you know what I'm saying? But I actually bought them for 140, you know what I'm saying? So if you guys are looking to go cop plus tax, 152, you know, not too bad, you know what I'm saying? So if you guys are looking to go cop, go cop them guys, you know what I'm saying? Um, It's just, it, it really what brought me to the sneakers was the holographic green. Like if you could see on the bottom, you know what I'm saying? They also have the Jumpman logo on the bottom, you know what I'm saying? And the holographic green. 
And I kind of, like I said earlier in the video, guys, I kind of like to call this a checker bottom. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, that's kind of what brought me to the sneaker. And plus, like I said, guys, I have a sweater to go with these sneakers. You know what I'm saying? So, oh, look, guys. Also, I had a sticker on here. You know what I'm saying? Which I haven't took off yet. You know what I'm saying? Like, I still have it on. You know what I'm saying? The sticker. So, you know, that's how you know. No, I, I, I've only worn these probably like, I would say, I've only worn these probably like three, four times, maybe four or five times the most, but I don't really, I, I wear my sneakers, but I really don't wear them like that, you know what I'm saying? Only when I have to, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, you know what I'm saying? Um, I like these guys, you know what I'm saying? And I'm going to say it one last time. If you're looking to go cop, guys, go cop. These will not be hard to find, you know what I'm saying? It has a nice suede, you know, a nice starfish suede, you know what I'm saying? A genuine leather, you know what I'm saying? Um, go cop, guys. Um, also, guys, these pay the tribute to the NBA colorways that came out in um, the 2000s. You know what I'm saying? So... Guys, if you ask me, these these are a good shoe because I haven't seen most people with these shoes. So if you're looking to go cop, guys, go cop these. I'm telling you guys, these are, you know what I'm saying? They're the best, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, I don't really do 13s, but with the holographic green, that's what brought me to the light, you know what I'm saying, guys? So, you know, make sure you guys tune in, you know what I'm saying? But... Um, that's gonna do it for this video, guys. Um, also, yeah, you know, also got my Jordan, um, Jumpman sticker, you know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah. And, uh, also, I also have my receipt, too. Let me see. Yeah, 140 plus tax, 152.43. Now, I'm saying, I don't know if you guys can see that, but, yeah, guys, I didn't pay too much for the sneakers, you know what I'm saying? I actually thought I was going to be paying around like 150, 160. No, no. I actually thought I was going to be paying around like 160, 170. Sorry about that. You know what I'm saying? But I wound up paying 140 plus tax 152, guys. So, you know what I'm saying? Um these sneakers won't be hard to find, you know what I'm saying? Go get them. Go cop good pair of sneakers, you know what I'm saying? good quality not too many people have them they're rare you know what i'm saying um air g um air g <laughs> air jordan 13 to starfish you know what i'm saying go cop guys go cop fire but guys um also guys i will be doing a video um if i get them i will be doing a video on the um the georgetown threes that came out today I will be doing a video on those, so stay tuned for those, you know what I'm saying? Those for adults, if you're looking to go get those for adults, those are actually the same retail price as these. Those are $190 and adults, and for kids, they're about $140, you know what I'm saying? And also, those were inspired in, um by Jordan from the NCAA March Madness, if you guys know about that. Also, I will be doing another video next week on the um the Jordan 5 Stealth 2.0, you know what I'm saying, which come on March 27th. I'll give you guys more details on that, you know what I'm saying? But I'm about to close this video out, guys. Don't forget to comment, like, share, subscribe, you know what I'm saying? Um, Let's get this video, guys. I would say to at least 200 likes, you know what I'm saying? Support your boy, you know what I'm saying? We out here, you know what I'm saying? And um, stay tuned for my other videos. We out, gang.